Hey everybody. Hi. Here we are. We're going to show you because we haven't done either of these yet, these insertions. Um, we wanted to show you what this looks like. When, oh, okay. So we're going to compare because we didn't do that before either. These are the two transmitters. The one on um, that Katie's holding in her left hand. Well, that would be the one in your right hand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so that's the G6. Okay, hold it. Hold them side by side. Okay, so you can see how the G6 transmitter is skinnier and it sits down further. <laughs> I can't and, keep uh, my hand straight. Forward. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, the G6 is a little bit longer, but it's slimmer. Okay. And, and we're going to put an iPort in. Well, well I'm going to put the iPort in. She's going to put the iPort in. I'm going to put the G6 in because this is our second insertion. And the inserter is, um, she's still getting used to how to hold that. Um, yeah, but it's so, a lot nicer. Yeah, okay, so take that out of the package. Okay. It looks like a Star Trek phaser. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Okay, so hold it still so we can see it. Okay, and hold up the, the G4 inserter that we have been using. And this is, no, inserter, the inserter. Okay, so they can compare what these look like. All right, so you see how the G4 was like a kind of a scary, clear, hypodermic looking thing. Um, and this is really sleek. You don't see the needle, nothing like that. So um, it's a lot less intimidating. And it has groupies. It has what? Oh, grippies, yeah. <laughs> okay, so this one, um, with this inserter here, you had to push down the plunger and pull up on the collar, and you, you felt every bit of it. Um, and this, one, this, you just press it once and pull it off. Yeah, and how was the pain level for that? Uh, at first I was going, eh, what? <laughs> Where's okay. the pain? I see friends, friends are here. Tessa's mom is here. Hi, Ellen. Hi. <laughs> okay, so um, we have. I have taken off her her sensor Did because I... it gave me an alert here. It actually doesn't leave much on the of receiver. A scar. Uh, our receiver looks like a little phone. Phone. Little baby. Okay, phone. so you see it says new sensor. Okay, so Katie, while I'm doing this, well, this is hard to manage. <laughs> it's hard to do. Okay, I'm gonna press new sensor. And then I have to unlock this, okay? And this, the way this works, on the bottom here is the sensor code, and that is what we plug in here. So, Katie, get an alcohol swab and clean off the area where we're going to put this. Did you clean it? No, but I want to. Hold on. Okay, so. Nine one five nine. Thank you. This is super easy to, I mean, I figured out how to do this the first time. So, is it correct? Yes. Okay, so next. All right, so we're going to insert the sensor. You cleaned it, you said? No. Clean it, I just, please. But, All right. look. Uh huh. That was where the sensor was. It doesn't leave almost nothing of a scar. Okay. And with the G4, it left like a really high bump and a few <laughs> <I did. laughs> lines and stuff. But okay. this one's nice. All right, so get a swab. And we got this. And that's Unisolve. And we don't really use this for the Dex because the Dex is usually pretty easy to get off. I love it. But the, um, mm. the eye port is super duper sticky, like it takes off a layer of skin. <laughs> it was really painful. It did. So we, we ordered. Hold still, please, Katie, for those who aren't familiar with this product. This is called Unisol. We ordered it off Amazon, and it works terrific. Okay. Yeah, you can see where my old iPort was. Yeah, there's the old iPort. Yeah, and that was a humdinger. That one, um, and there's yeah, a sometimes bit, you hit bleeders or you hit a nerve or something like that. You can kind of see it right here where the skin is yeah. still growing back from okay. the last can we Can we put that down? We talked about yeah. that. Clean the area where we're going to do this. Okay. okay. Like, so, the I pour or No, the Dex? we're going to do the decks first. Oh, yippee. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we're going to swap mm. sides. You still have some. Should we do the arm or tummy? Let's do tummy. Okay. Okay, and we'll use your arm for your. Ah, yeah. <laughs> I got some good okay. <laughs> okay. 
and whenever we do her shots, um, we're going to put her eye port on her arm, so that won't be an issue, but your shots need to be at least three inches from where you put this dex in, and that's always been true. Okay, is it all dry? Okay, is it all dry? A little bit sticky. All right, she doesn't have a problem. We have used, um, I don't think I have it here. We have used generic Flonase um, on the sites where she has reacted with the adhesive before, and that works pretty well too. All so. you do is you take this. I like how they put flaps. Yep. The other one they had it's, sort it's, of a flap. Yeah, this is really easy to peel off. Peel okay. those two off. Then take off the guard or the button. Um, Don't put your finger on the button. <laughs> no, I'm not putting my finger on the button. Okay. And you would do it. And then, okay. You She's still this. not comfortable with holding this herself. No. All right, so. Not there. Up. Down here. Down there. All right. Right there. There. Okay, so you just yep. press it, stick it on, and <laughs> one, two, three. I got an eyelash in my eye. How was the insertion, though? Uh, hurt a bit, but not, not much. very much. It's sore now. <laughs> yeah, because the, you know the nerves. They're saying, you know what? Uh -oh. I wasn't used to that, so. I love. Okay, so where are we gonna do your eye port? Let's do the other arm. Okay. This arm? Yep. Well, should we put this in? Okay, so yes. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to snap that in there. You just push it in, click Ouch. it. Was that the click? I can't tell because it's a little bit yeah, it's, harder. It's than... not as loud of a click. Mm -hmm. Right. So then we look at our phone here. Insert, attach the transmitter. Next. Yeah, it's in. Start and sensor. Now we put the sticky thing on. I'm gonna try to put the sticky thing on. Okay, out. it's gonna want me to unlock. Okay, so we have a two hour warm up, so we'll need to make sure that we're doing finger pokes if we do any correction or or dosing for a meal. Sorry, this is so shaky. I'm trying to do this one handed. Um, and at the end of two hours, we'll be up and running with a number. Okay, and Katie has put on, she uses Rocket X patches. I put a real stick. crazy one on. Yeah, flat one. Tomorrow we're going to do a blood draw. We are going to do a blood draw. Pray for Katie, okay? I'm not, that's I'm just not, not real really fun. So we're excited. trying to hydrate her really well. Her veins tend to roll. So, yeah, yeah. if you could pray for her, that would be terrific. Yeah. Tomorrow at 10. In the our hospital, time. I did a blood draw almost every hour. Yeah. It was bad. Yeah. Okay, get your eye port. Okay. Get your eye port. E port. Okay, and we need to clean the site for that one too. Hold on. All right, just make sure it's nice and. There's a swab. I know. Why can't we just use this one? Because we don't. Okay. <laughs> Reusing an alcohol wipe is just kind of ridiculous. Okay, first <laughs> we're take off this plastic take, take, stuff yep, off the side. Off. Then you pull up this. If I can, there we go. Okay. You pull that off. Okay. Take this lid off. Okay. There's the needle guard. This is my favorite part. She looks nervous. <laughs> okay. And then you there's pull the needle part. Twist, twist and, and pull. pull. Okay, there's the needle that will insert the then cannula. Just Whoop. Pull it back. Pull it till it clicks. Like that. Let's right. just set that Clean your sight. Yep. Yeah. She's a pro at this now. And what this does is it, it gives her one sight. Okay. Uh, every three days I instead of finding lots of different sites every day um, and it's helping to reduce we've noticed a big change in her arm where there's some scar tissue so we haven't this is done something on this arm for a while right because we were giving it a rest <laughs> okay make sure okay. it's dry still looks shiny is it dry cool okay all right, so then she's going to take that, which is already spring-loaded, and there's two little spots on the side that you squeeze. Can you do this? Nope. Okay. I know you can do it. One, two, three. Ouch. <laughs> okay, push down. Pull up on the white part, remember? Pull up on the white part. There you oh, go. Yeah. Okay, and it's on. So we'll do her shots in there for the next three days, and then we'll swap it out again. You can do Humalog and Lantus in there. They just need to be spaced by 30 minutes sore. if you're going to do that. Yeah, anything that you stick in your arm is going to make it feel sore. Ow. 
Yeah, because you have nerve endings in there, you know? I mean, I'd be worried if you didn't feel it at all. Okay, so, oh, I think... UFO. There it is. Looks like a little UFO. It does. And this is the mothership, and look, like, beam me up, squinty. Yep. And then we, we clip off those needles um, and dispense of them so that everything is safe. Okay, I think that's all that we wanted to show you, right? All right, so for those who were curious, I'm gonna post this on our YouTube channel too, um, because the G6 especially is new and there's not a lot of people using the iPort, so we wanted to show, um, oh, we have someone saying, great job, brave warrior, praying Ooh. for your blood draw tomorrow. Ooh. Keep up the hard work, Kat and Dwayne Pedrosa. Pedrosa, <laughs> is that Spanish? I believe so. Yeah, it sounds, sounds like, like Spanish. It anyway. Badrosa. Okay. <laughs> uh, I like that. All right. Badrosa. Marilyn says, way to go, inject a girl. You are brave and strong. Aaron? Tanya, nope. This is Marilyn, my friend Marilyn. Aaron. And Tanya Roberts Hi. Bourbon says, that's awesome. Great job, Katie. Oh. You're not going to know a lot of these people, Katie. <laughs> so, all right. if, if anybody has any questions, you can go ahead and post them um, for these products. Hi, this is <laughs> This is still our... Um, only our second G6 because you do that every 10 days so hence why we especially why we use the rocket X patches well it's weird is when I do my human log in here uh-huh it's weird because it stings and I try to I try to rub it but I can't rub it <laughs> yeah okay it turn, it's really weird because my human log hurts more than my Lantus. that's very surprising isn't it yeah but one of the things if you have kids those of you who are T1D moms if you have kids who are um, hesitant to do their own Lantus shots because those can sting, um, this got her over the hurdle of doing her own Lantus Ooh. shots, so that was great. Close on. What? Here we are with an empty chair again. Oh, sorry. Anybody have any questions? We have four people watching right now, and there's Ooh. people that will watch it afterwards. I feel the... Yes. Will you come around here so we can okay. see you? Okay. <laughs> see our messy bookshelf. Come here. What are you? Sh oh. These are the flavors that I use in my water bottles. The watermelon's almost gone. I haven't used this one yet because I don't really like the raspberry. Yeah, well, you know, it's a work in progress. But We're trying to get her uh, hydrated really well. So <laughs> I figured I would try something new because we haven't used anything like that before. Um, so, okay. I need a new water bottle I think they anyway. Know how to use these. <laughs> I need a new water bottle anyway. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna show. Hey, do you want to chug a whole bottle of water here while people watch you? Half. <laughs> Probably half. Okay, cheer her on because she she does not like water, and we and have found this that is the watermelon my favorite. Blood draws are really just not put happy. The top in. Give it one squirt. That's more than I did. Then close it up. Jordan Knight is watching. Who? <laughs> I told you, you're not going to know a lot of these people. Okay. <laughs> I accept that. <laughs> okay. Well, that's nice of you. And All right. Yeah. So, yeah. Let's cheer her on. Get it. Go, Katie. Drink that water. <laughs> <laughs> Your blood draw will go so much smoother if you're hydrated. So, we're happy that you're drinking water and people are sitting here across the country watching you drink water. <laughs> Should we do this for every water bottle? Uh -uh. I think that would be a good idea. Uh -uh. Maybe not. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh my. Uh. Yeah. So yeah, she has to have her A1C test. Um, uh -uh. We do that every three months. Go go go! Marilyn says. Go, Katie. Wanda says. <laughs> Drink that water. <laughs> go, Katie. Go. <laughs> Hot diggity dog, like your shirt says. So yeah, 10 o'clock tomorrow, we're going to be doing this. Uh, <laughs> uh, Everybody's happier when they're hydrated. You know, you think clearer. Uh, uh, yes, your body needs the water. This is a commercial for water for everybody. Right? Uh, Every mom watching would back me up on this. Drink your water. Awesome. Fantastic. Oh, we got thumbs up buttons and everything. <laughs> Done. Good job. All right. Whoops. Oh, I feel my stomach slosh. You did it, Wanda says. Uh, <laughs> like, like, like. Uh, Little buttons. Yay. I okay. thought water was supposed to keep you from having headaches, but now I have one. Well, no. Uh, 
I think you're crazy. I can feel my stomach headaches. like sloshing. <laughs> okay. We're going to say bye because, yeah, I think we, we've done everything constructive that we can do. And most people were watching this for the insertions, not necessarily to watch a drink one. Okay, so we'll see you later, friends. Ugh. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh, bye.